Hello, my name is Dr. Jamal J. Myrick and I am the Correspondent Secretary for the Muse Atlanta Chapter of Alpha Pi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated. And this past fraternal year, we've been busy. We've been busy since 1977 and that has not changed even during the pandemic. So I'm just going to give you some quick highlights about some of our programming and events that took place during this pandemic and during the fraternal year here in the Inland Empire. Since April 8th, we've had 12 programs that totaled 624 people in attendance, in attendance alone, 624 in terms of virtual engagement. So that is across our social media, across our outreach, across brothers getting in touch with people, 3,407 people have engaged with us on our social media and other platforms alone. That's since April 8th. First, the very first event on April 8th, we did a Census 101. There's been a lot of mis miscommunication, a lot of misinformation about the census. And so we felt it was our duty to make sure that the community is aware of what the census is, how it impacts our community for the next 10 years, and how we can do our part to make sure that we were counted. And we did that in partnership with the Blue Educational Foundation, and it was a fantastic event. The next event I wanna also highlight is the appointment secretary event where we had the California appointment secretary actually come in to our space to make sure that we engage and we make sure that we tell black and brown folks how to become and how to serve on local government as well as state government. A fantastic event that not only allotted folks from the whole entire state of California, but also outside of the state. And then finally, I also wanna highlight a wonderful event that we did in partnership with the Riverside branch of the NAACP, our week of action. And this week of action took place during a time of social unrest, during a time where black and brown bodies were being murdered and lynched by state sanctioned violence. And so we needed to make sure that we did not allow that movement to just be a moment. And so during this week of action, not only did we have a voter registration drive, not only did we have an opportunity for community members to engage with the Riverside Police Department chief, not only did we have an opportunity to talk about knowing your rights, we also created some space where we highlighted the youth and made sure that they also have a voice because that's what's important as well during these movements. And finally, I just want to say the Muse Island, the chapter of Alpha Alpha Fraternity Incorporated is here. And we are here to make sure that we have an impact, not just this moment, but for the future. And so I'm very proud and I'm very happy that I was able to share just a little bit about what our wonderful chapter is doing here in the Inland Empire, A5. Hello, my name is Charles Brown, a member of Musi Lambda Chapter, and I'm here to present the chapter's annual event in regards to our oral oratorical contest. This is an event where our scholars will have an opportunity from grades one through 12 to showcase their oratorical skills around current events affecting the African diaspora. So in terms of our presentations, we have grades one through five, six through eight, and nine through 12. Come out and celebrate in this annual event that happens. Our community can celebrate our scholars in this oratorical contest. Greetings, my name is Edward McMillan. I'm the chapter president of Musi Lambda Chapter. Musi Lambda Chapter of Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated, housed in the Inland Empire, seated in the city of Rialto. Our mission in Alpha Phi Alpha is to promote brotherhood and develop leaders. It is my hope that this year we expand and grow in committees and help the black community. We're working with um, the AFL program, which is our Athletes for Life program. We're also doing our national programs. Go to high school, go to college, Hopeless People to Hopeless People, Brother to Keeper, and Project Alpha. In each one of those programs, we want to touch different parts of the community and have different touch points with our young men and our young people of African descent. Our goal in Alpha Phi Alpha is to do our best to do our part in the Inland Empire to support this vision and this mission. Any, any support you can give us by way of a like, a share, or supporting our programs would be greatly appreciated.